The Cherokee Rose Riding Project is a branch of the National Riding Project, which is the only federally funded program that focuses on the teaching of riding. We are a local site that is housed at the University of West Georgia in the College of Education. The mission of the Cherokee Rose Riding Project is to serve local educators in the area of riding instruction and literacy. To do that, we offer professional learning opportunities such as a summer institute, Super Saturdays, we have a literacy conference that we host every year, and we also offer community events such as a writing marathon where we bring community members and area educators together to focus on writing. What I've found is uh, writing is hard to teach. Um, math, social studies, reading, science, they're all concrete subjects. When the students come, everything's prepared for them. Writing is the only one where they have to actually create for themselves. So I've been struggling all my career with managing how to teach. Um, one of the most important lessons was that in order for children to be accountable, they must be aware of themselves as writers. And the same thing can be said for their teachers. As writers, we have strengths and we have weaknesses. And if we're expecting our students to be able to tap into those things, we ourselves have to be able to be part of that writing community and show them that everybody has that natural ability. Well, I come seeking how I can get my children to thoroughly love and enjoy writing, um, not just from an informational text, but also from a fictional text, but more also, I learn more than anything about myself. Given that this is uh, my third year of teaching, uh, I still consider myself a little green, a newbie, so any opportunity that I can get to just meet other educators and find out, you know, pointers or any other thing that I could help me within the classroom, that's what I was looking for. What intrigued me the most about the Cherokee Rose Writing Project was how they inspire kids and inspire teachers to become creative writers. And I think that more than anything else is what we need to continue to hear at the K-12 level is that there's no really right or wrong way. There's not a formula that's gonna make somebody a, a good writer, but it's that idea of, of kids taking ownership of what they're writing. That has been a challenge. The year before, it was a tremendous challenge in getting kids to write. They had to write. I mean, there is not another way. <laughs> we have to read and we have to write, and writing is a huge component. But they were very resistant. They would, uh, I can't write. There was a lot of, I can't, I can't, I can't. So you know, when you hear children say, I can't, you have to find a way to get them past that obstacle. The main thing is giving them the voice. Like, what do you want to write? I'm just here to say, you know, kind of guide you, not tell you to write such and such and such. A lot of the philosophy of what Cherokee Rose is, is, is trying to instill in teachers is that love of, of writing and that creative component and, and letting kids use it as an outlet to express themselves so that they'll learn to love it versus coming into class and not wanting to write. I never hear a child say that anymore. I can't write. They know they can write. It, uh, there is not a child in this building who will tell you they can't write. So our ultimate goal is to work with teachers so that we can help them see themselves as writers so that in turn they can work with their students and allow them to see themselves as writers as well.